Stephen Barlett's Journey From the illusion of success to true fulfillment, Stephen Barlett's story challenges the conventional narrative of success. At 25, he was the CEO of a thriving startup, living a seemingly glamorous life with substantial wealth and a substantial social media following. However, when his company went public for $200 million, he found himself questioning the very foundations of his happiness and fulfillment. Born in Botswana and raised in a financially struggling household in the UK, Bartlett faced adversity from an early age. Despite being expelled from school, dropping out of university, and being disowned by his mother, he hustled to build his first company. At 18, he achieved his goal of becoming a happy sexy millionaire, but the reality fell short of the expectations. Barlett's journey serves as a powerful lesson in re-evaluating societal expectations and personal goals. He realized that his initial aspirations were misguided, influenced by external pressures. Instead of true fulfillment, love, and success, he found emptiness. Over the years, Bartlett underwent a transformative journey, discovering that genuine happiness and success lie beyond the facade of material wealth. If you're ready to break free from the illusion of the happy sexy millionaire and pursue a path of true fulfillment, love, and success, Barlett's insights can guide you on this journey. Kill Comparison The Dangers of Constant Relativity Stephen Barlett's journey highlights the impact of social comparison on our well-being. While reflecting on his life, Bartlett considered how different his perspective on enough would be if his family had stayed in their small village in Botswana, where the average life expectancy was just 49 in the early 2000s. Instead, he experienced life at the bottom of the social ladder in the UK, leading to inevitable comparisons with those better off around him. The human brain is naturally wired to compare and contrast, a survival mechanism that aids quick decision-making. However, in today's hyper-connected world, this tendency to compare ourselves to others, amplified by social media, can have detrimental effects on mental health. Constantly measuring ourselves against the seemingly perfect lives of influencers and celebrities can create feelings of inadequacy and stress. Bartlett advocates for a shift in this behavior, encouraging individuals to embrace a healthier approach. Instead of comparing oneself to external standards, he suggests focusing on personal growth by comparing the present self to the past self. The solution, according to Bartlett, is to strive for self-improvement and measure progress based on individual growth. Rather than being consumed by the unattainable standards set by social media influencers, he advises muting or unfollowing such figures. If one chooses to have inspirational figures in their life, Bartlett emphasizes the importance of selecting genuine role models who promote healthy ideals rather than commercialized images. The key is to break free from the constant comparison trap and cultivate a positive, self-driven journey. Center around connection. The power of genuine human relationships Stephen Bartlett emphasizes the importance of genuine human connection, asserting that while marriage, cohabiting relationships, or having children might not be suitable for everyone, authentic connections are essential for overall well-being. Citing a study of adults from Western countries, Bartlett notes that nearly half of the 20,000 participants felt lonely and lacked meaningful social interaction. Despite living in the connected generation, loneliness is pervasive and has been linked to early death and susceptibility to disease. Bartlett shares a personal experience from his entrepreneurial journey, where he, along with his friends Dom and Anthony, devoted extensive hours to work, leading isolated lives. Despite being successful in the social media business, their existence was far from social. It took a toll on their well-being, with Dom facing alcoholism and Anthony struggling with anxiety and depression. Bartlett clarifies that he doesn't subscribe to the idea that work is inherently evil. Instead, the issue lies in what they sacrificed for work. Neglecting psychological needs can lead to mental health challenges. Understanding this, Bartlett advocates for prioritizing relationships and connections, whether with friends, family, or in intimate relationships. He acknowledges that it's not easy, but investing time in meaningful connections has positively transformed his life and the lives of Dom and Anthony.
Bartlett encourages individuals to start prioritizing relationships today, as there will never be a perfect time, and doing so contributes to overall psychological well-being. Don't follow your passion, creating meaningful careers Stephen Bartlett challenges the conventional advice of follow your passion, asserting that it's not always practical or effective. Research supports the idea that individuals are often poor judges of what will genuinely make them happy. Bartlett shares his own experience of becoming one of the richest under 30-year-olds in the UK, highlighting the unpredictability of happiness and success. He criticizes traditional career counseling that encourages people to envision their dream job without acknowledging the need to actively create one's passion. Drawing from his deep involvement in business and entrepreneurship, Bartlett identifies five key ingredients for creating a meaningful career, task engagement, opportunity to serve, alignment with skills, supportive colleagues, and work-life harmony. While the proportions of these factors may vary for each individual, Bartlett suggests evaluating one's current job based on these criteria. If any essential element is lacking, efforts can be made to improve or, for those between jobs, these factors can serve as filters in the job search. Bartlett's message is not a call for mass resignation or a dismissal of traditional jobs. Instead, he encourages individuals to recognize that their dream job might be within their current circumstances if they actively work to shape it. The metaphorical idea that the grass is greener where it's watered, not where it's filtered for social media, reinforces the importance of investing effort into one's current situation. Stack instead of specialize. Embracing skill stacking for success, Stephen Bartlett emphasizes the power of skill stacking over specialization for success in the modern world. Despite being expelled from high school and leaving university after one lecture, Bartlett has achieved significant entrepreneurial success, attributing it to his unique skill stack, a combination of diverse yet complementary competencies. In today's hyper-globalized world, being in the top 10% across several skills is more effective and enjoyable than being the best at just one. Skill stacking liberates individuals from the pressure to compete and allows them to operate in a class of their own. To build a personal skill stack, Bartlett suggests a simple process. 1. Identify existing skills. List skills in which you feel you rank in or near the top 10% whether they are related to your profession or personal interests. Two essential industry skills. Identify the top two or three skills essential to your industry and evaluate whether you currently rank in or near the top 10% in each. If not, prioritize developing these core proficiencies. Three uncommon competencies. Consider competencies uncommon to your profession that could set you apart. Brainstorm skills or traits rarely seen in your workplace and make them your secret side missions after mastering core proficiencies. Skill stacking opens up new possibilities for success without the need to be the best at a single skill. It allows individuals to enjoy an upward spiral of growth and recognition in their unique class. Prize time. Making intentional bets with your limited hours, Stephen Bartlett urges individuals to recognize the finite nature of time and make intentional choices about how they spend their hours. Assuming an 80-year lifespan, one has around 700,000 hours, with approximately 500,000 active hours, considering 33 years spent in bed. To maintain perspective, Bartlett likens life to a giant roulette table, where each person comes with 500,000 chips, representing hours, and throws in one chip every hour. The key is to spend these chips wisely on priorities like work, family time, or exercise. Acknowledging mortality is a powerful tool for decision-making. Steve Jobs emphasized the importance of remembering one's mortality, and Marcus Aurelius advised living each day as if it were the last. Bartlett recommends clarifying values and priorities to guide actions. Determine what mountains are worth climbing and what marathons are worth running, then allocate chips accordingly. Bartlett suggests setting an aspirational hourly wage to help make decisions. For instance, if you value your time at $100 an hour, you can assess whether certain tasks, like cooking or cleaning, are worth doing yourself or if outsourcing them allows you to spend that time on more meaningful pursuits. 
In the game of life, the house always wins, and no one walks away with chips in hand. True success lies in making intentional, inherently satisfying bets with the limited time available. Final Summary True Fulfillment, Love, and Success Stephen Barlett's journey from a struggling background to achieving financial success teaches important lessons about true fulfillment, love, and success. Bartlett challenges the notion that external achievements, like wealth or a certain image, are the keys to happiness. Instead, he emphasizes mental well-being, genuine relationships, and personal growth as the foundations for a meaningful life. Bartlett's experience highlights the danger of blindly pursuing societal expectations and the happy sexy millionaire ideal. He discovered that achieving external goals didn't bring the internal satisfaction he sought. The pursuit of rock-hard abs or a seven-figure net worth, while valid in their own right, shouldn't be mistaken for the ultimate sources of fulfillment. The key takeaway is that external achievements alone won't satisfy internal needs. Barlett's insights encourage a shift in mindset, focusing on mental well-being, genuine connections, and personal development. By adopting even one of the mindsets or strategies presented, individuals can move closer to discovering their true selves and leading a more fulfilled, loved, and successful life. Welcome back, and thank you for returning to our enriching space of knowledge. Here, you have a treasure trove of captivating book summaries designed to arm you with thought-provoking insights and uplifting stories that can inspire you to take massive action. To help us reach a broader audience and spread the joy of learning, we invite you to show your support by liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel. Your support is not merely appreciated, it forms the very foundation of our mission. In return, we pledge to consistently provide you with high-quality book summaries in a timely manner. Let's continue our shared journey toward growth and enlightenment. Here is to joyful reading, continuous learning, and ongoing personal development.